Hey, welcome to a new video. Everybody loves to swim, especially in the summer. Of course, a swimming pool should not be missing from your vacation destination. Today we've done our best to find pools that you probably didn't know about, and that you won't believe exist. Are you new to this channel? Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And before we start, also like the video. The Badstip Pool is located on the Spree River in the German capital of Berlin. The reason for this is because the river itself is very polluted, and you don't really want to swim in it. A local artist named Suzanne Lawrence came up with the idea of creating a public pool which opened in the summer of 2014. The pool is open from 8 in the morning to midnight. Especially during the summer days, it can be very crowded. Right in front of the pool, there's a bar and a building with a club where DJs play mainly in the summer. There's also sports facilities nearby, and right in front of the pool, there's a kind of beach where people can relax. Finally, there are then several plateaus that lead out to the pool where people can sit. The Badstrip Pool is a very popular place, so it's usually very crowded, so keep that in mind if you want to go here. I came across a picture of someone swimming in a dark tunnel several times on YouTube, but no one gave any information with it. So I decided to do some research and found out that this is probably the creation of the architect Pimer Zumthor. The tunnel belongs to the five-star hotel Therm Vals in the municipality of Vals in Switzerland and is located at an altitude of 1,252 meters above sea level. It took him two years to complete and both the interior and exterior are made of special kind of rock. The building is full of labyrinth-like rooms and tunnels where you can swim and is partially located under the Swiss landscape. Swimming here won't be relaxing for everyone as its long corridors and high ceilings might make you feel claustrophobic. People who have been here say that the thermal water provides a deep spiritual experience. Furthermore, you can also go for hikes around the Dash Mountain, and in the winter, you have the opportunity to go skiing and snowboarding. The Jade Mountain Resort is a five-star hotel located on the Caribbean island of St. Lucia. To book a room here, you'll spend around 1,300 euros per night. But for some, this is well worth it, especially after you see the beautiful views of the sea and mountains. The hotel is built high into the landscape, and each hotel room has its own balcony with a private pool. The hotel also has a superb restaurant, and you can ride a bicycle to explore the surrounding countryside. Some rooms have an additional hot tub, and you can even book a massage to be given in your own hotel room. According to several articles, this hotel has won over 10 awards for the best honeymoon destination. During this tropical vacation, you could also go hiking through the rainforest, mountain climbing, and even snorkeling. From cold Austria, we now arrive at a place called Amangiri, located in the U.S. state of Utah, that is surrounded by canyons and fully integrated with the landscape. If you love nature and complete tranquility and would like to wake up in a hotel with a beautiful view of the desert, then this place is for you. Unfortunately, not everybody will be able to afford it, because just one night here with the minimum price is 2,000 euros. The hotel has several spas, steam rooms, saunas, and a pool built around 165 million year old sandstone rock. From what I've been able to find, this place is loved by celebrities like Justin and Hailey Bieber, Kim Kardashian, and even Kylie Jenner. The area is very remote, so walking through the desert area is relaxing and definitely an experience you won't get anywhere else in the world. When I came across this pool called Aquadome, I thought, wow, I definitely need to add this one to the list. It actually has a design that I'd never seen before. The Aquadome is located in Tyrol, Austria, in a district called Langenfeld. It's located between the Otzel Mountains, and at first it looks like you're in an alien place. There's two giant saucers and a small one with a pyramid-like structure in the middle that leads you to the pools. The pools are heated with sulfur-rich thermal spring water, and it's about 35 degrees Celsius. Around the dishes, there's a pool, and inside the hotel, there's an indoor pool where you can swim. You can, of course, book a night in the hotel, but you can also just pay for a few hours to enjoy the pool. In 2019, a building opened in Vancouver, Canada, where they have a pool that sits between the two buildings. The pool can be found on the 20th floor and has a glass bottom where you can look down 60 meters on the city square below you. It's said that the glass bottom can support a weight of 1,650 cars, and the pool is about 1.5 meters deep. The families who decide to live here can swim whenever they want. If you can't afford to live here, you can also book a night to still enjoy the pool. In addition to the pool, there's also a sauna, a steam room, and a hot tub. 
A pool at such a height with a glass bottom is certainly not for everybody, but it's a unique experience. If you want to swim at night, the lighting gives you a colorful ceiling that can also be seen from the first floor. The Galaxy Hotel is located in Macau, a region that belongs to the People's Republic of China. The five-star hotel features an outdoor pool that is a whopping 575 meters long. So grab an inflatable floaty and let the rapids push you forward. If you like lazy rivers, then this is definitely one to put on your bucket list. At one point, you end up in a transparent area where you can see tourists walking below you. The entire area is an incredible 75,000 square meters. It also has a wave pool, waterfalls that you can stand under, a place for children to play, and even a water slide that runs through the artificial mountain. If you decide to go here on vacation, it will undoubtedly be a lot of fun. There's also casinos to be found in Macau, which many people say can match the feeling of Las Vegas. The next pool on this list is located in the Alps of Switzerland, in the town of Edinburgh. The five-star hotel called Wiener Honig is located at an altitude of 914 meters above sea level and has an incredible outdoor pool. You might be thinking, isn't it cold? Nope, because the pool itself is heated year-round to about 33 degrees Celsius. In the middle of the pool, there's a semicircular seating area, which serves as a bubble bath at the same time. You can also relax on the edge of the pool and look out over the beautiful mountains and the Verwitz-stricken lake. If you want to stay here one day, it'll cost you easily about 600 euros. Besides the pool, you also have the opportunity to hike in the mountains or even to ski in the winter. If you prefer to stay in the hotel, they also have a fitness center, a sauna, an indoor pool, and a restaurant with very good food. When you see the following video footage, you would think it was filmed in the deep ocean, but it's not. This is a deep dive, a 197-foot or 60-meter deep pool located in Dubai. It's Dubai's newest attraction that recently opened and is known as the deepest pool in the world. Just to give you a better comparison, it's a whopping 3.7 million gallons or 14 million liters of water and is the size of six Olympic swimming pools. Because the pool is so big and deep, the designers decided to make it a sunken city to give the dive a special experience. The pool is safe because it has more than 56 cameras installed to keep an eye on the divers. In addition, the staff is always on the lookout in case something happens. When it comes to luxury, the Titanic Martin Palace definitely belongs on this list. Located in the Turkish city of Antalya, this hotel has one of the largest outdoor swimming pools in Europe. It was built by a wealthy businessman, Telmen Ismolov, and was officially opened on May 23rd of 2009. The luxury hotel is said to have cost an incredible 1.5 billion US dollars, or 1.26 billion euros. Many celebrities attended the opening, including Mariah Carey, Kendall Jenner, and Paris Hilton. The hotel has multiple pools, the outdoor pool of which has an area of 32,000 square feet, or 9,700 square meters. Some of these pools flow directly onto a sandy beach in the Mediterranean Sea. In the middle of the outdoor pool, there's also a fish restaurant, with four large aquariums that have more than 3,000 different species of fish. In addition, it has 30 other restaurants, entertainment facilities, and even a golf course. With all that, the Martin Palace really lives up to its recognition as a five-star hotel. The Serengeti National Park is located in Tanzania and covers an area of 9,320 square miles, or 15,000 square kilometers. In the middle of this area is the Four Seasons Safari Hotel. The hotel has a swimming pool that overlooks a pool where herds of elephants and zebras come to drink water. For those interested in wildlife, this is the perfect opportunity to get close to wild animals, while still at a safe distance and relaxing in the pool. The pool is intentionally elevated so that guests have an amazing view. The idea of the hotel is to allow people who don't want to go on a safari to still have a similar experience. Imagine relaxing in the pool with a cocktail on the side while enjoying the wildlife. Who wouldn't want that? If you want to relax after an entertaining adventure, you should definitely visit the Las Grutas Talatango in Hidalgo, Mexico City. This place moves at an altitude of 4,200 feet, or 1,280 meters above sea level, and has several caves, tunnels, and hot springs built into a cliff. In addition to the hot springs, there's an underwater thermal pool and a turquoise-colored river that flows through the area. The pools are heated naturally year-round by the surrounding volcanic mountains. If you love to explore caves, then this place is also highly recommended. 
Nearby, there are hotels, campsites, restaurants, a suspension bridge, and even a zip line. Las Grutas Tolatongo is known as a Mexican paradise for a reason. The Alpen Panorama Hotel by Herbertus, located in South Tyrol, Italy, has a pool called the Sky Pool. The pool floats 12 meters above the ground and gives you a panoramic view of the Dolomite mountain range. All year round, this sky pool is heated at 91.5 degrees Fahrenheit, or 33 degrees Celsius. There's also a small glass window at the bottom of the pool. In addition, the hotel has six other heated indoor and outdoor pools with multiple saunas. If you like winter sports, this is a place for you, because the ski area in the Dolomites is considered one of the best places for skiing. So if you're looking for active and relaxing activities, I would definitely recommend visiting the Alpen Panorama Hotel. Porto Moniz is a municipality on the island of Madeira that belongs to Portugal, where only 3,000 people live. But these people have good taste, because they have a beautiful natural swimming pool that overlooks the Atlantic Ocean. The island is a wonderful vacation destination where you can swim, scuba dive, and hang out on the beautiful rock formations that have been formed by volcanic activity. Another activity that's highly recommended is the diving board that emerges into the ocean. However, you can only go off the diving board if the sea isn't too rough that day. Does this seem like a great vacation destination to you? Let me know in those comments. The Japanese are world famous for their clever innovations in advanced technologies. And this pool, which is called the Magic Pool, is one of their amazing creations. The pool went viral on the internet because it looks like you can walk underwater without getting wet. So, unfortunately, it's not an actual pool that you can swim in, but it's actually part of an exhibit at the Museum of Contemporary Art in Kanazawa, Japan. So it looks like people can walk underwater without breathing. Below is a passageway where people can enter the empty pool. For those who love sports and going out, the Stadium Swim at Circa Resort and Casino in Las Vegas is a true paradise. It has a capacity of 4,000 people and a 144-foot or 44-meter wide 14 million megapixel LED screen that's been installed where guests can watch their favorite sports games while relaxing in the pool. There's also plenty of sunbeds, and in addition, there's lounges, a DJ booth for music, bars you can swim to, and because it's Vegas we're talking about, you can also gamble at the pool. In the winter, the pool's also heated so guests can enjoy the water any time of the year. I think this pool is a big dream for any sports fan. This pool belongs to the TWA Hotel and is located at the John F. Kennedy International Airport in New York. It's a wonderful destination if you love watching planes, because while you're in the pool, you can watch the planes take off from the airport. The hotel opened in 1962, and since then, it has about 512 rooms that you could stay in. It also has a large conference room, a museum about the history of aviation, and a wide range of restaurants, including the Sunken Lounge, where even the Beatles performed in 1965. But while you're here, be sure to take a swim in the infinity pool that overlooks the runway of JFK Airport. In the winter, the pool is heated to 95 degrees Fahrenheit, or 35 degrees Celsius, so guests can still enjoy the view, even when it's cold outside. On the Indonesian island of Bali lies the town of Ubud, which is considered the cultural center of the island. Here is also where the Hanging Gardens is located. It's a very luxurious resort in the middle of the island, about a half hour drive from the town of Ubud. The private resort is located in the heart of the jungle and offers a multi-level pool and luxurious hot tubs. While enjoying the various pools, you're surrounded by mountains, volcanoes, and surrounding forests, which gives an incredible view. If you do want a little more privacy, you can also enjoy it in one of the rooms. Each room has its own private pool. Not only do the pools give a fantastic view of the rainforest, but opposite of the pool is the incredible Balinese temple. The Hanging Gardens Resort contains about 44 villas, and if you want to come here, you'll be taken to the location via one of the two funaculars from the hill. I wouldn't be surprised if you've seen a video from one of these channels on YouTube. These people create incredible swimming pools and other survival type homes. They build these in an area where there's a lot of bamboo. Locals still use these techniques regularly. Some of the pools they build are completely hidden underground, while others are built a few meters above the ground. The incredible thing about this is that everything is built using only primitive tools and methods. Unfortunately, I couldn't find much about the creators or owners of these channels, but it's fascinating to watch. YouTube channels like these are watched by millions of people. 
Villa on the Rocks is located in the municipality of Brandal in France. This incredible villa is built into a hillside and offers a spectacular 28-meter-long aquarium-like pool with transparent walls that overlook the first floor of the house. So you can watch people swim just like you watch fish in an aquarium. This masterpiece was designed by the famous architect Rudy Ricciotti and was completed in 2006. The house has three levels, and when you've just woken up, you can jump straight into the swimming pool. This one also overlooks the ocean and surrounding nature. If you want to spend a night there, it'll cost you about 600 euros per night. France has been a popular vacation destination for years, especially on the south of the Mediterranean coast. The villa can accommodate up to 10 people, so it's perfect for a vacation with friends or family. Koh Samui is an island located in the Gulf of Thailand, about 560 kilometers south of Bangkok. Here you'll find a pool, which instead of clear blue water, shows a red color. The striking effect is created by a mosaic of orange, yellow, and red tiles. One of the things that makes this pool so unique is the contrast with the blue ocean in the background. If you love reading books, this is the perfect place. The reason why this place is called the Library Pool is because there's a library with an impressive collection of books. The hotel is located near the Chewang Beach, which is also known for its nightlife. This pool was considered by TripAdvisor as one of the most spectacular pools in the world. The Sinoti Kill at Chichen Itza was one of the most important cities of the Mayans, and here you find the Pyramid of Kukulkan. Chichen Itza is located not far from the edge of the ancient crater of Chicxulub. The famous crater was formed by the impact that probably made an end of the dinosaurs. There's not much to see on the surface, except for the sea notes. A sea note is the name for a water-containing cave. One of the sea notes named Sea Note Ikil is one of the seven wonders of the world, and is one of the most visited sites in Yucatan, located on a peninsula between the Gulf of Mexico and the Caribbean Sea. A scary fact is that the Mayans probably used this place for their rituals, but today there are only waterfalls in crystal clear water. Would you like to take a dip in this natural pool? If you dare, you could also jump down the stairs into the water. The Grand Wale Resort is located on Maui, an island in Hawaii on one of the best beaches in the world. It's a 40-acre luxury resort and was built by Japanese developer Takashi Sekaguchi. The hotel is said to have cost as much as $650 million. This location looks stunning. The Walea Canyon activity pool is 2,000 meters long, and it consists of nine pools on six separate levels. And there are multiple water slides, a whitewater raft with rapids, a pool with a sandy beach, jacuzzis, six waterfalls, but the most unique is the world's first water elevator. You enter this place through a kind of bunker-like door, then you take a seat and you are taken to the different levels. Probably it'll be faster to go by the stairs, but it's definitely a unique experience. Another fun activity they have is the fish pipe. It's kind of a rotating water ride, and up to three people can go at a time. The unique spa resort named Kaweki in Unison is located about 80 kilometers from Tokyo, in the town of Hakone in Japan. This water park is famous for its rather bizarre whirlpools. They have 26 baths, some of which are filled with green tea, coffee, and even red wine. If you want, you can even drink it from the 3.6 meter bottle while bathing. If you're old enough, of course. According to some experts, it even has positive effects on human health. For example, it's said to rejuvenate your body. You might think it's gross to swim in red wine with other people, but the contents of the pool are clean daily. They also have a chocolate bath, but this is only opened on Valentine's Day. Of course, this water park also has normal pools, water slides, and even an outdoor pool. But I think the tourists come mainly for the wine pool. This new pool, which opened around the fall of 2019, is not just any pool. It's the world's deepest pool, with which it will dethrone the pool from Italy named Y40. The new pool is located in Mixano, about 50 kilometers southwest of Warsaw, the capital of Poland. The cool thing about this 45-meter deep pool is that there are multiple corridor systems and underwater caves to explore. In addition, there will be a glass tunnel that visitors can walk through and take a look at people diving. There's also a number of hotel rooms that overlook this pool. The team behind this project hopes that the pool will be a perfect place for professional or experienced divers to practice their skills. But beginners are of course welcome as well. The pool named Deep Spot holds 8,000 cubic meters of water, which is comparable to 27 pools of 25 meters long. 
Y40 Deep Joy is one of the deepest swimming pools in the world, located in a hotel in the municipality of Montegrado, Therm in Italy. The pool is 42 feet deep and is certainly not for the faint-hearted. It's said to contain an incredible 4,300 cubic meters of water, and it was first opened in June 2014. The water in the pool is heated, and it's a popular spot for people who love to dive. Not only does Y40 go 42 meters deep, but it also has several special caves for you to explore. Before doing this, you must sign a slip of paper in case something happens, and only experienced divers are allowed to swim it to the bottom. Most people don't go deeper than 20 meters, because the pressure of the water can make you faint. If you are in this hotel and you don't dare to swim here, you can also look at people from behind a glass window, and there's even a tunnel that you can walk through. The Yulang Shuyan Water Park is one of the largest of its kind, and is located in the Chinese city of Longjing. The water park has several types of attractions, including a wave pool that can create some of the highest waves in the world. However, in the summer of 2019, news came that there would have been a malfunction with the equipment in the control room of the wave pool. This caused a tsunami-like wave from which some people were thrown out of the pool. Some people had to be taken to the hospital, but luckily everyone was okay. Still, this is a sign that you should stay alert when you decide to go into a wave pool, but don't let it stop you from swimming, as things like this hardly ever happen. Devil's Pool is a natural swimming pool located on the edge of Victoria Falls in Zambia, a country in East Africa. The Victoria Falls has a height of 108 meters and are said to have formed naturally thousands of years ago. As soon as you jump into the water, the current pushes you to the edge of the waterfall. There's someone there who ensures that everything goes well, but there have still been people who unfortunately fell off the ledge. Yet every year, there are enough tourists who are happy to swim there. The Victoria Falls are among the largest in the world, with a width of no less than 1,700 meters. The best time to visit this place is between August and January, but it depends on the current water levels. Skellefte is a place in the north of Sweden where the Scandinavian Swimming Championships are held every year in February. This is a competition that is only meant for people who are not afraid of the cold. The pool is specifically cut from the thick ice so that the competition can be held. As you might already guess, the temperature is extremely low, and there's also medical people on the side watching should something happen. People who are not used to the cold may hyperventilate, and it could become difficult to breathe at some point. You might think why these people don't just choose a heated pool, but experts say the cold water has health benefits, including boosting your circulation and immunity. Swimmers of all ages are welcome though, so if you're not afraid of a little cold, this might be for you. Siam Park is a large water park located in Spain, on the largest island of the Canary Islands, Tenerife. Siam Park is one of the most impressive water parks in the world, costing around 52 million euros to build. It has a classic Thai structure with fire-breathing dragons, temples, and over 20 different attractions. One of these is the Shark Tank, a kind of water slide that opens into a tunnel where the sharks swim around you. But in this park, they also have a wave pool called Wave Palace which has the highest artificial waves in the world. These waves can reach a height of no less than three meters. It sounds like a lot of fun, but when it's very busy in the pool, I would be very careful. Wave Palace is also a popular destination for surfers who use the pool to practice their sport. Most pools have fairly clear water, but this pool or mud bath is located in Piparo, a village in Trinidad and Tobago in the Caribbean. These mud baths are created by the eruption of mud or slurries, water and gases. There are over 15 different mud volcanoes in Trinidad, and the danger lies in the unpredictability of an eruption. The last major eruption happened on February 22, 1997, in the small village of Piparo. The mud baths are used as a popular tourist destination, and the temperatures can vary between 2 and 100 degrees Celsius. Liao Mikel is one of the mud baths you can swim in, which isn't too hot. Close by is also the sea where you can rinse off the mud. According to local people who live in the village, the mud is also supposed to cleanse and rejuvenate your skin. Would you ever want to try this? Let me know in those comments. Queen's Bath is a small hole located by natural origin, surrounded by volcanic rocks on the island of Kauai in Hawaii. It's also called the Pool of Death, and this place is certainly not for every swimmer. The water is very rough, especially in winter, and even the Hawaii government doesn't recommend visiting this place. When the sea is calm, this place looks breathtaking to take pictures for your Instagram. 
But there's also several videos on YouTube in which you can see how strong these currents are and how high the waves can hit the rock walls. Unfortunately, several people who have swum here didn't survive. The Homestead Crater is a geothermal pool in the state of Utah that is hidden in a 55 meter high limestone cave. This was formed about 10,000 years ago when melting snow from the Wasatch Mountains seeped deep into the earth. As a result of volcanic activities, this heated the cave at a depth of more than 3 kilometers. The hole above the crater lets in a little sunlight, while the pool remains heated all year round at around 35 degrees Celsius. In 1996, people had made a tunnel in the rock face so that they could reach the site. Over the years, it attracted many tourists and diving enthusiasts. However, there are a number of rules. You may only swim in the water for 40 minutes if it's not that busy. Since you're literally at the bottom of a volcano, it can be quite scary. Bali is an Indonesian island and is known as a beautiful vacation destination. The area called Uluwatu is very popular with surfers, and at the southern tip of the island is the five-star resort called The Edge. It has eight beautiful villas that you can book for about 800 euros a night. Furthermore, there are two swimming pools, a gym, several bars and restaurants, a tennis court, a play area for children, and a butler who's ready to serve you 24 hours a day. But the best part is the pool that overlooks the Indian Ocean. The pool even hangs 6 meters over the edge of the 162 meter high cliffs and has transparent glass that you can look through. Now, this isn't for people who don't like heights, but if I may believe the reviews, this is an unforgettable experience you won't forget anytime soon. Crocosaurus Cove is a zoo in Darwin, Australia that is home to about 70 species of reptiles. The park's main attraction is the Cage of Death. Some of Australia's largest saltwater crocodiles swim here, and you can admire them up close if you want. You'll be put in a glass cage that goes in the water for about 10 to 15 minutes. You can enter the cage with two people at the same time, and the crocodiles are fed at the same time so that they swim around you more actively. A fun fact is that one of the crocodiles is over 80 years old. However, this attraction has an age limit of 15 years, and you want to be a bit of a daredevil to do this. If you find this too scary, you can also view this crocodile from behind a glass window. But the park also has a museum where you can learn about all these animals. And a little further, you can even find some smaller crocodiles. Marina Bay Sands is a luxury resort located in a marine bay in Singapore. The project in total cost over 5 billion euros to produce. The entire complex features 2,561 rooms, sports halls, two large theater halls, seven-star restaurants, and one of the largest casinos in the world. The most beautiful part of the Marina Bay is the pool that is located on the roof of three large skyscrapers, which are connected to each other. It's the world's tallest pool, and you can literally sit at the edge of the pool and enjoy the view of the skyline of Singapore. When you're done swimming, you get a free towel, and you can chill on a luxurious lounger in the shade under a palm tree. They also have several jacuzzis that overlook the ocean. All you need for this is to be a guest of the hotel, so it does cost quite a bit of money. But if you like heights, it's definitely an incredible experience. Anyone who loves swimming pools and is on the internet a lot probably knows about the Embassy Gardens swimming pool in London that hangs 115 feet or 35 meters above the street. The pool was first a concept, but officially opened on May 26, 2021. It's not for people who are afraid of heights, but in addition to being a pool, it also has a bridge where people can walk from one building to another. Because the pool consists of a glass frame, swimmers can see the busy streets below them. Unfortunately, not everyone is allowed to swim here, as the pool is only for residents and their guests. Would you dare to swim here? Let me know in those comments. Tokyo Summerland is an amusement park in Akiruno, a city in Japan, known for one of the busiest swimming pools in the world. Every summer, thousands of people are coming to the park to enjoy the wave pool. A wave pool, as most people know, is an attraction where the waves of the sea are simulated. This park is often overcrowded, with people standing against each other with inflatable floats. If you're claustrophobic, this probably isn't for you, but apparently it can be even crazier. In Sichuan, China, they have a pool known as the Dead Sea. In the summer of 2016, it was 40 degrees Celsius, causing literally 10,000 people to go to the crowded pool. I think a few hundred people are already too much, but when you see this, you spontaneously don't feel like swimming anymore. And then also the fact that you can easily lose sight of each other. 
San Alfonso del Mar is a resort found off the coast of the Pacific Ocean, located in Angoboro, Chile. This is the world's largest pool and is a whopping one kilometer long. It covers eight hectares and contains 250 million liters of seawater. The pool is about 3.5 meters deep. The water is pumped from the ocean and filtered, and the temperature is kept around 26 degrees Celsius. You might ask yourself, why is a pool being built right in front of the ocean? The reason is because people don't like to dive into the ocean that much, as there's often sharks swimming near the shore. The pool was developed by the entrepreneur, Fernando Fishman, and the official opening was in 2006. Because this pool is so large, you can even scuba dive and sail with a boat. It's said that it costs the owners as much as $4 million per year to keep the pool clean. In the number one spot on the list, we have the Blue Lagoon, a geothermal pool located near Grindavik in Iceland. The pool is very popular and something you should visit if you find yourself in Iceland. The Blue Lagoon is located around Lava Rock and was first opened in 1992. The geothermal heated water comes from a nearby power plant that pumps hot water from the ground through turbines and generates energy at the same time. The water has a temperature of approximately 38 degrees Celsius and is rich in minerals and silicates that gives it its light blue color. The water is even said to have a healing effect and would be good for your skin. Nearby, you can also grab a bite to eat at a restaurant built into an 800-year-old lava cliff. This, in addition to the pool, is a very unique experience, so it makes a lot of sense that more than a million people visit this place every year. Which swimming pool would you want to try on this list? Let me know in those comments. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos we've made, click one on the screen or take a look at the channel. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.